Hey guys, um, I'm here with our Tech Feed News correspondent, Dale Chase. Uh, we've done a few stories recently leading up to DEF CON, which is the big hacker conference that happens in Las Vegas every year. And Dale was our uh, kind of man on the ground at DEF CON, so we're going to talk to you about some things that you saw. Um, but first I want to ask you, how do you prepare for going, going to DEF CON? I mean, assuming it's a bunch of hackers trying to one-up each other, how do you guard yourself when going to a conference like this? Uh, the first thing is make sure that your laptop is not trusting anything. Like how you, you, know, you get to home or you get to work and it automatically logs onto your home or uh, work network. Uh, you want to turn Wi-Fi off. You, you want to make sure that you are making sh you know, you're telling it where to log on. Because there are folks with devices um, that will pretend to be these networks and just say, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm your home or <laughs> work network. And we'll just sit in the middle and just sniff all your traffic. <laughs> Uh, same thing with your phone, you know, make sure Wi-Fi is off, uh, Bluetooth off, um, also that goes for the laptop. Um, and you also want to turn your data off as well. So how do you communicate with people? It, it is tough. <laughs> I mean, I was in a situation where I was trying to, you know, keep tabs on some other folks. You know, we had a little um, a Google kind of thing going on. And uh, so I kept my data on, you know, and just tried to keep an eye on things. But yeah, you, you really should take turn it off. Yeah. Uh, and you were also telling me earlier about a wall of shame. <laughs> yeah. That people yeah. don't want to be featured on. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. So there's a network there that you know you know that are a, a, a Wi-Fi network or, or LAN network that's free to use for folks. But if you're doing things unprotected, you you know your information will get snagged and posted on this huge projection <laughs> in one of the like you know contest areas. Um, called the wall of shame, you know, where they'll post like, you know, your IP address and your email address and maybe some other information, you know? Yeah, <laughs> yeah it, it's a long running thing. Yeah. So, so tell us, you know, what, what were the exhibitions like this year? I mean, how did it di differ from last year? What kind of things did you see? I'm not sure how things might have differed, but I did see some really cool things. I checked out uh, this femtocell uh, exploit uh, that, that people have been talking about. Uh, they were doing a presentation on that. And uh, it's really incredible how these consumer devices now that, you know, uh, the carriers are giving to people and, you know, to extend their cellular range are actually really vulnerable to some nasty things um, like easily cloning phones, eavesdropping on phone conversations, SMS, um, and you know, grabbing your data is also possible. Um, it just they just haven't bothered decoding it yet. <laughs> <laughs> They'll get to it eventually, yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> um, and I also know that it's not strictly computer-based hacking there. No, no. Um, all you kinds of... You learn how to pick locks. Yeah, yeah. I even bought myself a lockpick set, <laughs> like, determined to learn this year. Um, yeah, lockpicking, um, uh, tampering with seals, like envelopes, or, you know, kind of things that you'd find on, you know, your blueberry containers, that kind of stuff. Um, or, you know, anything that, you know, you, 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 you go to the store and you say, okay, this looks like it hasn't been opened. They're coming up with ways to open it and shut it down again without you knowing. Oh my god. <laughs> so who, who attends DEF CON? Is it mostly white hat type hackers or is it kind of a mix of people? It's probably a mix, but predominantly white ha hackers. Um, it's folks who realize that society is moving towards this very electronic, computer-driven society. And uh, you know, people need to be aware of uh, the dangers of you know, applications that aren't locked down, you know, not secure. And uh, they're just trying to spread the gospel, essentially, and share ideas with each other and kind of push the envelope as far as like, making things more secure. And I, I was reading something about vehicle hacking. Did you hear about any of that? Yeah, yeah, I checked out the talk on that. Um, and uh, yeah, um, GPS spoofing is a, a real viable, you know, exploit. You know, can take a car and make it think that it's here and send it off the road or bring down a helicopter with just blasting it with a super strong signal of your own GPS, um, you know, lo location. And so it will like try to correct its course to because to, now it thinks it's someplace else to get back on course so like you you know you you could end up bringing the thing down or sending something off the road by making it think it's not where it is um, you can trick camera sensors into thinking that a wall is not a wall by painting it a certain glossy black or you know uh, and uh, yeah um, 
uh, autonomous vehicles definitely need to be uh, checked out. And this is not this is the time to do it now. You know, now that Google is working on them and these things are being brought to light, so that when they do come out to the consumer level, that these things have already been you know taken care of. Um, and what else did you do there? I heard you perform too. Yeah, I was actually down there to uh, do some shows with uh, my friends Dual Core. Um, this is their. Uh, current album, All the Things. Um, yeah, I, they actually won uh, a Pony Award for uh, that song. And uh, yeah, I was uh, running around uh, doing shows with them like every night, sometimes two. I think we got up to three shows one night. <laughs> it was out of control. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so any, anything else that you want to mention or places people can go to check out more about DEF CON? Uh, yeah, actually uh, they just premiered the DEF CON documentary, um, which is uh, free to download. This is actually a torrent. <laughs> of course, Obviously. Uh, so legally using BitTorrent. Uh, so yeah, so you can probably check that out at uh, defcon.org. All right, well, thank you so much for talking to us. I guess I know who to contact now next time I get locked out of the Revision 3 offices, as has been known to happen. <laughs> not, not, not yes. <laughs> anyway, uh, questions, comments, as always, leave them in the section below, and uh, we'll see you guys later in the day.